Welcome to Enphase. This is the IQ cabling. We have the single phase IQ cabling and the multi phase IQ cabling. The single phase IQ cabling is a two wire, two and a half millimeter soft core cable with different lengths between the connectors. We have solutions for portrait, landscape, and extra large modules. The multi phase cable is also available in portrait, landscape, and extra large sizes and is always connecting to one microinverter. Keep in mind, that the first connector might be L1, the second L2, and the third L3, and so forth. As long as you take the IQ cabling from one box, you will always have a phase imbalance of, with a maximum of one microinverter. The cables are also numbered, so you always know exactly how many you take from each box. We have an assortment of accessories for our IQ cabling. Excluded here are the field wireable connectors, but the main ones are our disconnect tool, which can be used to disconnect the IQ cabling from your microinverter, but also can be used to disconnect the module via the MC4 disconnection. It's also used to disconnect the IQ seal, which is used to get a watertight seal on unused connectors. Lastly, we have the single phase IQ terminator and the multi phase IQ terminator. The single phase IQ terminator consists of three parts a hex nut, a rubber grommet, and the terminator body. When assembling the terminator, make sure that the two wires are separated inside the terminator body. Always make sure that the rubber grommet is facing upwards with the edge. And when assembling with the hex nut, hold the terminator body in place with a screwdriver or the disconnect tool. And then make sure that once you tighten it once, it will never be loosened again because that is the only way to secure an IP67 rating. The multi-phase IQ Terminator also consists of three parts, but the assembly is slightly different. We again have a Terminator body. The rubber grommet is inside this middle piece. When assembling the multi-phase IQ Terminator, there's a little edge in the middle part to make sure that the wires only go as far as they need to. You can then fold them over and cut them around the edges and put the covering on top. This in essence completes the seal. With the hex nut you can then fasten it again, make sure that you don't over fasten it, but also keep in mind that once it's connected once, this also completes an IP67 seal. If you open it, it's broken and you will have to replace it. If you want to know more about our products, visit our documentation center on the website www.enphase.com.